Together we are making progress for all. Of the DA-led municipalities, an impressive 29 are in the Western Cape. From Mitsikama to Beaufort West, from Pito to Cape Town, real change is coming to all residents. Thanks to your hard work, the DA has grown substantially in the last few years. With the city of Cape Town, Swartland, Drakenstein and Stellenbosch municipalities each receiving over 65% of support in 2016's local government elections. This is a clear sign that where the DA governs, residents are experiencing the real change that comes with honest, efficient governance. Each one of you have contributed to these excellent results. The Western Cape has the lowest unemployment rate in South Africa. Over half a million jobs have been created since we took office in 2009, and more residents are hopeful of finding work here than in any other province. Finding work is especially hard for young South Africans. To help our youth get ahead, we have created a number of programs, like the Premier's Advancement of Youth Internship Program, which has created 4,300 internships since it began in 2012. We have also launched seven youth cafes across the province, offering support, services and opportunities to our young people. Our DA-led government's goal is to introduce 32,500 qualified apprentices into the labour market by 2019 by working with TVET colleges and employers. Ensuring quality education is another way that we create a brighter future for our young people in the province. In fact, the National Minister of Education praised us for having the best education department in the country. More students in the Western Cape than anywhere else in South Africa qualified for university in 2016. Before the DA took over, the ANC built only 34 schools. But in the same space of time, we have built an incredible 118 schools, including replacement schools. We have reduced the number of poor performing schools from 78 in 2009 to just 19 in 2016. Over the next three years, our DA-led province will spend an incredible 65.6 billion rand to develop our youth and improve our education. Access to information and opportunities with the internet is also vital. That is why our province is working hard to deliver Wi-Fi to every ward by 2018. We also know that our youth will never have a chance unless we wage war against gangs and drugs. The province has tripled the number of substance abuse treatment sites to provide support to victims and their families. And we are doing our best to create opportunities for young people in our communities by creating jobs and cleaning up corruption. A clear indication that we are improving healthcare in the province is the fact that we have the highest life expectancy rate in the country. The percentage of HIV and TB related deaths goes down every year and we have the lowest percentage of newborn deaths in South Africa. The Auditor General has praised the Western Cape Premier's office for being the best at helping to deliver sound, clean financial management to the country. 80% of Western Cape municipalities received clean audits. In stark contrast, 
the second-placed ANC-led KZN managed only 18% clean audits. This means that more money meant for the people is spent on the people. Every DA activist knows that our main job is to ensure that all residents live with dignity. Key to this is a home where you feel safe and comfortable. There is still much more to be done, but the Western Cape currently boasts the highest known rate of land reform in South Africa. Every municipality works hard to ensure its residents have proper access to piped water, flushing sanitation and electricity, and to provide residents with a home that they can pass on to their children. We have successfully delivered 89,000 title deeds to beneficiaries since 2009. We work hard every day to improve access to quality housing. The service excellence of DA-led municipalities across the province sets an example for the rest of the country. Working together, we are showing that real change is possible, that we can create a new beginning for South Africa, a new beginning that delivers honest government, jobs, and better service delivery for all. We are united behind a shared vision of one nation with one future. Let's see a DA president in the union buildings in 2019.